this is Christina from Christina's Cherished Treasures, and I've been working on flowers this morning. Um, I watched a tutorial a few days ago on flower making, and it was a really easy way to make them. So this is not my idea. Um, I will definitely put a link to the original video um, in the description. Anyways, here is some of the ones I've been working on this morning. And these really, they are so super easy. Um, you don't have to use much hot glue. Uh, so it's just, a, it's an easier way. my little camera on my lamp. Oh, I'm going to have to get away from my lamp. Here's another one I did. And another one. Anyways, these are just super, super easy. And these big flowers are made uh, using two-inch glue dots. This one here, I used an inch and a half circle and put the mini glue dots all over it and it still works really really good to make smaller ones also um, I don't think they make inch and a half or inch and a quarter glue dots they may but I haven't seen them anyways this is my inch two inch glue dots and you can attach this like this um, Got it at Hobby Lobby for $4.99. Now, if you get 40% coupon, you can get it a lot cheaper. You start with taking the backing off of it on one side and laying it down. And then you start with whatever lace you want to use. And you just go around the edge and gather it and stick it down. such a cool idea and I thought you know what I'm gonna do a tutorial I've never done one well I have two but they're like so teeny but I'm still in the learning stage and I found this wonderful craft just a couple years ago and there was a big old designer for scrapbooking online for quite a long time for a lot of years and I decided that I need to branch out and start doing more hands-on things so and you just kind of keep going around and around I don't really have any measurement of, of how much lace I'm using I just leave it on the rolls the spool and just work my way around until the center is done and they're just these are so easy and so quick simple there's not a lot of mess I've been trying to do the flowers with the glue done and there's just so many glue strings all over the place frustrated with it so anyways and you just keep going around and around until you get to where you want it and then you just snip it off snip it in there a little bit I am using for the center one of Saw Crafters buckles with the little lavender um, Pearl brads, they come with two different flavors. And really, this is it as far as glue. You just put a little glue here and pop that in the center, and you have a gorgeous, gorgeous lace flower. It's just, I love them. They're just too cool to do. And I have a punch.
want to be careful. You don't want to pull. You want to take your time taking these off. Otherwise, it will stress your flower out of shape. And we have a lot more to go. And I have a cup holder in here for you until I figured out what I was doing. And then you just put your two-inch circle on the back. And you have a beautiful flower. And it ain't got a cake. So, <laughs> got to figure out a way to do my little camera. That upsets me because I like to have the room all have a tripod for me. But I can't anyway. Anyways, that's my flower tutorial. I hope you like it. Thanks for stopping by.